Fellow Americans and fellow pen freaks, tomorrow is Memorial Day. I say this with deep sadness, as many will celebrate a day that reminds us that the greatest cost of freedom is life. Many lives, hundreds of thousands of men, some good, some bad, but all united in the proliferation of freedom, not for themselves, but for the millions of brothers, sisters, mothers, fathers, uncles, aunts, wives, husbands, sons, daughters, friends, and pets they all left behind in the name of God and country. Those who have left us behind far too soon will not be here on the day we call Memorial Day. They will not be able to turn to their wives and smell their hair, turn to their child and hand them a hot dog, pet their dog, share a beer with a friend, tell anyone ever again that they love them. No, on this day, they can only be here with us in spirit. On this Memorial Day, let us please not forget that the day is for the recognition of the most costly luxury we enjoy on a day-to-day -day basis. It is not about barbecues, beer, or food. It's about those that can only be here with us in spirit. Don't forget that, because if you do, then they won't be here with us at all.